Super Mario, Super Mario, Super Mario World. Super Mario World, it's a blast from the past. It's Super Mario World, you got to move fast. Mario and Luigi are doing what they can. Yoshi and the princess are giving them a pen. Super Mario World, Super Mario World. It's a blast from the past. In Super Mario World, it's a blast. <laughs> you know, Luigi, living in Dinosaur World can be bad for your health. I see what you mean. Yeah, trouble at every turn. Huh, see? The cave people are always hurting themselves. Look over there. Ooh, that's smuts. Always having accidents. Oh, oh, oh Chukumba. Yoshi fall. I saw what happened. Show me where it hurts, Yoshi. <laughs> Good thing Band-Aids come in four sizes. Small, medium, large, and dinosaur! <laughs> that should make your dinosaur feel better, Yoshi. What we really need is an emergency number to call. <laughs> like right now, for instance. That's the biggest dinosaur I've ever seen. And he looks awfully hungry. Not to mention just plain awful. Emergency number! Emergency number! Only trouble is, Yoshi, calling an emergency number doesn't work without a telephone. What telephone do? Well, it carries sound. Ow! <laughs> Coco Boo Boo! Hmm. I've got it. Watch this, Luigi. Why coconuts? No, melons are too juicy. They drip in your ears. Here, let's try it. Hello? Luigi? Can you hear me? Sorry, I have a coconut in my ear. Try talking to me, Einstein. Okay. Hello? Mario, are you there? Yes, 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 I'm here. <laughs> I've done it! Ish, congratulations, Alexander Graham Mario. Speak to me. Mario, are you there? <laughs> yeah. Darn, somebody put me on hold. I've reinvented the telephone! <laughs> Our first payphone! Isn't it great, Luigi? Check it out! Now, if there's an emergency or an accident, the cave people can call for help! A phone in every dome! Gee, I hope everyone doesn't decide to reach out and touch someone at the same time! No way! You worry too much, Luigi! Hello, Dome Central. This is your princess speaking. Sorry, that vine is busy. Power Kanga! Yoshi here, Uktar! Yoshi here, Uktar, too good! <laughs> Who need telephone? Maybe you're right, Luigi. Princess Toadstool is getting too wrapped up in her work. This whole telephone business is getting out of hand. Look! Those vines are multiplying as we speak! I thought air pollution was bad, but vine pollution? The noise pollution is worse! Well, they might talk less if we sent them a phone bill. Problem is, they can't read. Ah, the payphone idea didn't work. Nothing stops them. And now, the crops are dying from neglect, while all they do is gossip. They don't work, they don't play, they've turned into foam junkies. If they don't tend their crops, they don't eat. If they don't eat, they'll starve. It could be the end of cave people kind. Speaking of which... Earthquake! Worse than that, caterpillar quake! Oh, they're everywhere! Yeah, I'll fix them. Oh! Number. I don't have any cards! Do what the cave people do! Bash the block! 
Fuck! Uh, why do I feel guilty about this? You're gonna feel a lot guiltier if I end up as Caterpillar Joe! Help! Caterpillar, knock! It's, it's busy! Climb, Luigi! It's our only hope! <laughs> Our telephone vines! That'll solve the phone problem. Yeah, but what about our problem? <laughs> We're trapped in these vines. The cave people are too busy talking on the phone to help us. Wait! Floating blocks! They do hide to reach! Ow! Yeah. Whoa! Mario! Get the star, Luigi! All right, Invincible Luigi at your service! Time to kick some caterpillar! Help! Pest control! You cold? Yeah, make these critters bug off! These will be the first caterpillars in orbit! Hey, scoop that phone out of order. Plumbers fix phone fast. Look there on party line with bodacious babes. What have we done? Mario, uh, help! Uh, I can't move! <clears throat> This is a fine state of affairs. Listen to them. A few vines go down and they go crazy. I need a break. Ugh. We have to get rid of these telephone vines before they choke out what passes for civilization around here. Oof. Or choke us out, too. People are too busy talking on the phone to notice a thing. They'll be sitting ducks. Now you can say that again. All they do is quack, quack, quack. Luigi, you and the princess warn the cave people. I'll distract our hungry friend. If you really want to know, everything got stolen. I just put a shell up next to your ear. To get the latest word on anything you might have heard, the final tell you what you need to hear. You don't need to scream. <laughs> Call me Mario Da Vinci. I just invented the dinocopter. Gosh, the cave people even talk on the phone in their sleep. This is our big chance to get things back to normal. By tomorrow, they'll have forgotten they ever had a phone system. These vines are going down permanently. Next time we have an emergency around here, we're going to rely on good old lung power to see us through. <laughs> Keep eating, Yosh! Oh, Yoshi having vine time, Mario! <laughs> <laughs> Uh, 
What do you think, guys? Uh, the field's fine, but uh, I don't think the cave people are wild about being farmers. Especially when all they have to do when they're hungry is reach out and grab some grub. <laughs> yum, yum, yum. Good idea. Mario, if Luigi thinks that he can teach the cave people farming, let him try. Sure, they're gonna love it. Right, guys? Right! First, we learn how to plow. All you gotta do is make a straight line. Go, Yoshi! It's a cinch! You see? Nothing to it! This is better than bad, Dad. This is baddest. If those cave cretins succeed in growing their own food, I'll never be able to subjugate them. Unless, Luigi's oh, reptile of repulsiveness, we stole all the crops. We could start a famine. The cave people would have to come to me for food. It's brilliant. Glad I thought of it. I'll leave the details in good claws. If those cave loads get anything growing, I'm counting on you to plan map it. I will be ever vigilant, oh perfidious parent of peevishness. Hey, planting is simple. It's just putting things in the ground. <coughs> Assuming it gets to the ground. You guys can put stuff in the ground, can't you? Unga <coughs> gonna be so easy. Rats! If they can't grow crops, I'll have nothing to steal. There's no way to get this wrong, right guys? Angela! Now, go get some water! Out to me. Hey, big brother, when that crop is in, you're gonna eat those words. As well as some very good vegetables. I can taste them already. Cave carrots, stone squash, pebble peas. Hmm. Well, Mama always said you were good at growing. Yeah, well, that's why I'm the tall one, little big brother. <laughs> Oh, yeah! 